put myself center, then I'm going to be looking more at the camera when I'm sort of looking at myself to make sure I'm holding the, the cards up right. Um, I suppose we should post in the server. Oh. Yes. Oh, I like the... Uh, yeah, the borders. Yeah, well, I normally have a purple border for myself, so I'm like, well, I need to give you a border. So I was like, cool. Uh, hey, I've got... I've got... I've got Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta here as well. I've got a mascot. <laughs> but I, 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 it took forever to try and find a good background. I was like, this is a good background. This one looks, this one's just cool. I like this background. For some reason, I'm, I'm Super versus your like GT. In, yeah, your suit. <laughs> I'm original but shit, and you're not original but also shit. Yeah. Wait, why am I, why am I shit? Like. The manga of Super is way better than the anime. I still, yeah, I, I think because my like download thing has just decided to like when I download it, it was like here's this chapter, and then it's like okay, cool, now it's chapter ten. I'm like, wait, what? And I was like, what? what? This, it was just all over. The yeah, place. the Tori were having, uh, not Tori, but what they called Ta Taki Yomi were having some trouble, but yeah, I've got it working now. They've they fixed the issue. They were get <laughs> their website was getting blocked, so. Oh, it's going to be weird because I'm seeing you in a delay, but hearing you bef not in a delay, if that makes sense. Yeah, yeah I, I mean, you're probably looking at my face and be like, hey, why is he, why is he his mouth not moving before he actually speaks? It's, it's a bit like watching dubbed live action films. I've got, hey, where, where are my Godzilla films? We could be. <laughs> oh, uh... Do I, what, what do I have that could be considered good luck to aid me? My rubber band ball. Oh, bugger. This is my good luck proper band ball. I'm going to give it a squeeze. There we go. Should we post in the server that we're doing this? Try and get uh, any, some, some, some viewers. I was just about to. Well, it's your server. It's your stream, so yeah. Um, unpack cards. Uh, unbox cards? It's weird when it's like a... Is it not a, bo a box? Opening, just like... for opening. Just for opening. Oh, that's a good one. Opening. Why didn't I think of that? Because <laughs> I've been. I was, I, was, I was typing unpacking. I'm like, there's a word for this. Oh, oh, should, we be, yeah. should we be COVID safe and put our face masks on? Mine sounds so sorry. Oh, okay. I, I, I have one here. My lovely little Smurgle one from earlier. <laughs> oh, please stop touching my snow. Ah, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> No, I have the COVID. Make sure I put the actual... I was like, I'll tweet it. And I was like, oh, yeah. Oh, I mean, put it in there. I was like, oh, wait. And then also, you know, actually put the Switch link in there. Actually, I need to adjust my camera. It's a little too high. I, I think mine... then. What, mine's fine, I think. Maybe. Yeah. yeah, I mean, if I was being nitpicky, I'd like your central, but that's just me. I mean, I, that's more, I can't get more central because of just, like, thy bed is here, like. <laughs> you prefer to be more left-leaning. Uh, always got to remember your political roots, bro. Uh, wait, you, you have political roots now? Yeah, uh, sure, why not? <laughs> wait, when did you run for, what, the Green Party, Liberal Democrats? Monster Labor? Raving. That's uh, Raven Looney Party. Yeah. Oh, I I did recently get a uh, Dragon Ball Super top trumps. Oh, I wonder if. Oh, I have to show us some of those. I am. I'm showing them now. You will. You can see them in my delay. I think there's there are multiples of characters. So like, there's Ultra Instinct Goku and Normal Goku. Oh, I see him. Yeah. Yeah. We just play Rose Goku Black. <laughs> And Goku Black. Uh, <clears throat> yes. Oh, actually, I probably should get the XL ad open. Why have I got an at symbol on my phone? That's a new note. Oh, it's, it's Twitter. I wasn't. I'm not used Twitter, to chatting I... me. <laughs> it's been a while. It is. It's like. Well, I ah. thought I'd tweet it out, and because it's you know, I I I, I linked to you. That's true. I should probably. Oh, I already got rid of the notification. I was like, oh yeah, and I was like, oh yeah, I could actually 
Because I, I tweeted about it earlier and I was like, hey, I'm boxing things. But I, I think my my also my Twitter also just goes out automatically. So yeah, yeah I think you've got a, the thing for it. So we've got two people. I think they're probably actually just us watching ourselves. <laughs> well, I've got to watch it so I can see you. Uh, I've got the stream muted because I didn't want to hear you in delayed audio, which could also lead to my headphones looping it so I get you talking and then you talking and then you'd hear you talking. That's too much talking. Uh, oh yeah, Excel. That's what's going to get out of my spreadsheet that I made uh, when I was bored. The things we do uh, works. Yeah, I've got it open as well. Because it... there are some character names here I don't recognise, like Amon Amondo. Just a quick glance and uh, <clears throat> Nezu. I think actually, I think I recognise who that one is. Uh, I don't think we're going to be any shocked, but they go, "Who's this? Who would we put this under?" Is yeah, this Zero? I, I, I put the uh, ID on there because I think those are on the cards. I don't know. I can't remember. I don't. I don't remember where I put my actual cards. The, the three or so I had before, which were. Bardock, uh, Tia, Tien, and Vegito. Oh, where have they gone? They're somewhere. How are you? How are you opening? Because I've got, you know, I, I, I've got a pair of scissors I can grab. So if I get really stuck ripping open the packets, are you just going to go? Hurrah! I do have scissors in case I need them. I don't know, because it's got a Terry bit like at the, on the top right. Yeah. So. I like the little hole for um, hanging them up on uh, railings. Yeah. None, none and just how much of that could be folded before you get to actual card. Yeah, also the side as well. It's like, how much, it's, it's, it's way too, mu too, too, too much space. They've made a packet for like your standard nine card pack and then I've only put a third of that in. Yeah, they are very much, I think they're like ma magic size, but for some reason the cards aren't. Like, it just... It's been a while since I brought booster packs, so but they, they, they look maybe a little bit taller because the banner at the top I think makes them look a bit longer than normal trading card packs. Yeah. Hmm. It's got Toei on the back. It's PPM. Got, it's got the the card checklist on the back of the box, and I believe it's on the back of each of the card packs as well. Oh. So if we really get stuck, we've got, you know, we can look at the Japanese and translate. We can look at the... Wait, are there, are there only 30 cards? I Maybe I'd, my spreadsheet's wrong. And... Well, it says 30 plus one at the bottom of the box here. And I've never worked out what that meant. I assume that's there's 30 cards in the checklist plus one secret card. Then why why did I get up 80? Is that like, a, is, is it, are they like, is this like 2.5? I don't know. I... These match up. I mean, got... These all are B BM two, and this is Big Bang Mission. So unless you've got, unless we've got the wrong checklist, maybe. I think I went. I gave. I used the one Hang you on. sent me. So, like, yeah, these card IDs seem to be poom. These ones are. Mm, I don't know. We'll we'll find out as we go along. <laughs> we... Yes. Uh, I guess I could go first since I am number one. Number one. That is me. Right, yep. I was going to say flip a coil or something, but I guess you picked number one when we were shuffling them, so. Yes, because uh, I wanted to send that gif. Should we um, get a little drum roll going? <laughs> uh, oh, 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 stuck on the card. Eh. Oh, wow, that that's looks like a lot more than I thought there would be. Oh, okay. oh yes. Oh wait, I uh, yes this. already. Oh no, I'm not already happy by what I got already. So I've got. So you got a black and white advertisement card that I just saw. Yeah. So okay. So it looks that... like. So I've got Devil Man. I think you got De nice. Hang on. Let me check the list. Is Devil Man in the list? I think he is. Uh, Control F, Devil. I think. These are not matching the serial numbers I have in that list, so I think that list is wrong. 
Uh, whoops. <laughs> that's not so, that's not Devil Man. That's Lucifer. Oh yeah. Oh, Lucifer might be in the list already then. Yeah, uh, he's it... from the uh, one of the Dragon Ball movies. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, we watched that. We watched the terrible. Yeah, we, w- I... we watched the big green dub of it. Oh, yeah, so we've got. Shiny I've got him in my. Uh, I've got him in my tub of uh, mini Dragon Ball figures from years gone by. He's in here somewhere. I've got. I thought. Oh, I think this is Zeno Z- Z- Vegito. It looks Super Saiyan because I can see the back of the card. Oh, he's got earrings. Oh, is that not? Oh, is, that Trunk... like... is that Trunks? Is that Trunks and um, Vegeta fused together? Oh, yeah, he could be. So did... I know that that is one, isn't it? Like Vegeta Trunks or something. Yes, I'm sorry. I don't... It's got a special logo, which I think is their abilities. I've not seen any of these cards. Okay, this guy, I have no idea. He is uh... very, very, very purpley. But oh, is that the one you were like? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, that looks like um, Demigra. Yeah. I think that's a form of Demigra. He also like looks like that, God like, furry, like furry, like Toa, uh, Toa Mira when they like fuse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd say that's a high, um, a high point card. <laughs> yeah, I think, it's got a lot I think of. It's got... I think defense. I can't remember what the it's HP. Oh, maybe HP Orange attack and defense. Our entire um, card rating system is thrown out the window because the, the list we got isn't this isn't Big Bang Mission. Yep, that's fine. Oh, actually, I, while I you open those, the, I'll, I'll, look, the I'll two, search. Yeah, I think the two got. super ones that you got were probably worth more than Lucifer from Heroes. No, from Lu- Dragon Ball. Lu- Lucifer's pretty cool in my book. He's a pretty cool looking villain. Yeah. Uh, okay. Where's the there's the advertising card? Oh, oh, okay. So, um, I've got, I've got, uh, Young Bulma, I think. Oh, uh, Young Bulma. Yeah, I think, I think she's yeah. in the game, like the the game we played. I seem to recall using that that Bulma or a version of her. I've got. She's like an assist. I've got the old Kai, the elder Grand Kai from that other universe, the one that yeah. spoke about. Whose name I don't remember. And I have the box art Super Saiyan 4 uh, Goku from the front of the packs. Nice. I mean, it's got to be a good one if it's on the box. Yeah, like that's usually not the hardest one. It's got like a uh, fancy things on it. It's got like. A, it's, <laughs> he's Element Bullshit, which is fantastic. He's got a lot of uh, HP as well. Oh, his HP's only 2000. But he's got. He actually doesn't actually look to be that much stronger than these cards. But like, he he looks pretty. Almost 083. For us, that's all that really matters because we're probably not going to use these until. Well, <laughs> for, for for a long time. Okay, you're right. That card I did get is uh, V Kenks. Which... Yeah. It's, yeah, Vegeta and. Trump. Unfortunately, I think I think you've gotten more points in that first set of cards than I did because you got two super uh, two hero exclusive characters but I already got like one. Yeah. A strong looking one though. And I did get Lucifer. Who is Lucifer's pretty good. I mean having said that, according to the, the card checklist that was in the pack, uh Pum P U S A O three is an ultra rare. Ooh. I'm trying to see if I can figure them out oh. from the yeah. card. So I did at least that spreadsheet as the key, but I don't see the stars anywhere on them. No, I don't see any. Well, Bulma's got a star, but I think that's just part of the card design. Yeah. It's weird they don't... So that's... You'd think they'd put rarity on the card. That's normally a... Okay, so... Yeah, spreadsheet's wrong, so... Ah, but we can still use the point system on it, because we can check it off against the thing, because we've got... Common, I guess, is anything that hasn't got a letter next to it, and there's rare, super rare, ultimate rare. I don't know what secret rare counts as, though. I guess that's if we get a card that has a 
you are that's not listed in the list. Oh, there's also... So, yeah, I was... Oh, no, because there's super rare, ultra, ultimate rare, and then, yeah, secret, which apparently is the star system. Because I was like, oh, the star system, okay, that's cool. We can tell it from there. And I was like, where's the stars? I don't see no stars. Where is my stars? Yeah, we may have to do, we may have to devise a way. I've I found them on that site, so if I could somehow link back to the actual list of where they are. I mean, they're nice cards. So Super Dragon Ball Heroes Big Bang Bo Booster Pack Two. If I search for that, which I'm pretty sure that took me to what I wanted, is it, unless it takes me to a different list, that just takes me to the box. But this is the site I found that was very helpful to find me the card. Oh. Tell me the bo show me the card. Oh, yes, I think this takes me to the same list I've I used for that spreadsheet, which is weird. I'm just trying to find if I see if I can find any other the cards we've currently pulled, which I don't think I can. So why is it taking me to this list? Professionalism. That's us. I mean. <laughs> I, I did pre we did prepare to be fair well oh, oh, yeah, we, we, we set all this stuff up and then it just fell apart it fell apart because it, it essentially just took me to a list that's not the one if these weren't so expensive yeah. I would have probably yeah been able to bought one extra or something just to open to check the checklist yeah because these have got very different card numbers these are all got these are all BM twos. Whereas ours are uh Pumbs. Pums eight. Pums eight. Uh... No, I would have thought these would be BM two, so unless these are like such a new there's Pum 7 listed on one of them as a, like a filter, but these are Pum's 8. I don't know. I think we just we just don't unbox and uh, say fuck the list. Yeah, we, we'll have to just argue our way through which cards are the coolest. Anyway, it's your turn to open a pack. Yeah, all right. That's awesome. so I, I think I think this is a pretty good one, though. I'm, I'm, I'm quite happy with, with this. I mean, uh, like I said, box art, box art character is normally, is normally one That's of the like, best ones. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, where's my putting? There we go. Discard of packs. Oh, hello. Okay. Okay, I don't want that. The problem is you can't uh, like hold the back of the card up to the cam so we can't see it while you go ooh because we can still oh. sort of see like the photo profile shot from the back of the card. I had a new follower. Lizinto. Hey, new follower. Uh right, I've got like uh Janemba that's eaten some steroids. Oh, Hulky Janemba. Yeah, he's very hulky and just he's his his sword is very girthy compared to his normal sword. That is a pretty cool Janumba. Uh, it is. I'm very pleased with like anything that's just not standard Dragon Ball. Uh, yeah, basically. you've got more non-standard Dragon Ball than I have. Uh, well, we've got I've got I've got Krillin and Goku. Come on, guard. Oh, that's pretty neat. That's uh, yeah, the children Dragon Ball ones. Yeah. Are they also element BS? Uh, what do you mean element BS? Uh, you see the bottom left card? There's like a circle with some letters in it. Yeah, where your finger is. I can't. I can't uh, read what it is. H is it HE? I think it's HE. Uh, HR. Yeah, HR. You got to call cool HR. Oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna have to call HR. There's two kids fighting. Yes. Uh, and I've got a very. A very shiny Goku. Oh, a very shiny Goku. Yeah, he's even got Ooh, very shiny Super Saiyan God Goku, yeah. yeah his, his gear's slightly... I don't know if that's just a weird colouring, because the gear's not quite right. It's very orange. 
Yeah, but it's also like black instead of blue. Maybe that's um, the Xeno version or something. Maybe. It's very weird looking. But I think that means you will have to undo the cards. Now. Open, up, open up my pack. Yeah. yeah. Let's see who we get. Who we going to get? I can't open it. The damn thing. Fossil strength. Might... There we go. Uh, I have a very shiny looking card. Oh, I am actually confused. <laughs> yes. Yeah, let's check card out. That's what we wanted. I've got. Oh, neat. I've got blue water lady. I think that's a blue water lady. It's hard to tell sometimes with anime. I I don't know who this character is. Yeah, she looks kind of like Fu. Or Few? No, Few is the name. Yeah. Of it. It's like a Kai kind of look. Yeah, sort of. I've got um, a very ripped looking hit. That's yeah, very ripped. So, uh, yeah. And I have the evil Dr. Wily, apparently. Dr. Wily. Dr. Wily. Oh, he was in the list, wasn't he? So it's like he a... was in the list, but. I don't know if that's the same card that was in the list. Definitely, yeah, definitely wasn't. Doctor W, Doctor W. Doctor W. So that's uh, another decent enough pull. Yeah, you got you got Apparently something. Doctor that's... W is a rare card, I guess. PMS twenty one. Twenty one isn't got a number on it, and six also doesn't have a number. So I guess those are common. Well, let's see. I'll, I'll pull it. There you go. Don't want to. Don't want to show my hand. See, see, we... get out of the cart pack, you bastard. Oh, hello. Uh, okay, okay. This is, this is new. Okay, 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 okay. This guy is currently ready for a party. I don't know who he is. Oh sweet, sweet say hello. He, oh, he, I. It looks like um. Oh, who's that? Who's the Nazi in the Red Ribbon Army? He, he looks a blue? bit like General Blue, but at the same time, he look. Hmm. No, I don't recognise him. I think he maybe he's in the like. only chapters of. But no, I don't think so. Well, that's two characters we've encountered so far. We don't know who they are. Yeah, and I, I. He's got like a. He's got like an X scar on him. Uh, I know this I've lady. Seen him in, like one of the hero promotional like mangas, but not like they didn't explain it. Oh, uh, Supreme Kai of the South is that? Uh, no. Yeah. West? Yeah. yeah. It's, uh, I can't remember which. Which I, ca I think East is the one that's still alive that we know. Yeah, East is the one that's still alive. That for some reason, like all the other universes have that one, just one, then, one. Yeah. No, no uh, brave guys. Yeah, it's the Western one. Um, yeah, it's the Western I've, one. I've got. I'm getting a theme. You're getting a theme. Is yeah, it Junember? Oh, Jesus. that's a pretty cool art, though. And the Junember's armor black in that one. Uh, this one is is kind of just. I think it's just sli slightly tinted the color, but I think it's more more normal Junember. What's the Pum's code on that card? Because that looks like a UR to me. Uh, his pums mm -hmm. is a ten. I should probably have the pums key up. Ten is an SR. Ooh, super, super rare. Oh. If we're doing this properly, we try and like protect the booster pack so we can like look at them in the future. Oh, I, I feel like I should be deducted points now because I've already had a. Yeah, I've got a double. Oh, we got the first double, double of the night. Hit. Got a double of hit, so that's a little disappointing. But I do have Grand Supreme Kai. Ooh! Don't don't you don't see Grand Supreme Kai that often, and um, I don't know who he is. But he's P P U S thirty, which is just a rare card. But he does look like every evil demon realm character combined. I'm just follow that a little bit closer to the camera. Focus. So yeah, uh, the yeah, camera's not wanting to focus on the card. I don't know how the focus on this works. There's very few settings I can twink. Uh, you, you you can twink. 
<laughs> oops, oops, oops. Yeah. They'll say I got a double, but you know. Better twink this twink this camera. But I'll take I'll take these demon realm looking evil guys. Yeah. yeah, basically take take anyone who's like just non standard, like, oh look it it's Goku. Great, thanks, thanks guys. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> it's Bulma, hooray. <laughs> At least it's a different different than normal outfit. Bulma. Yeah, it is a like Dragon Ball era outfit. Ooh, look at that perfect cut. Right. Ooh. Nice. Okay. It's like a cheese string. Ooh. Oh, ho, ho, baby. Oh, I got I got my first double. But I think it's it's very hard to tell. I think this is uh, he's a fusion, so it's a, a little harder to tell. And it's saying three hair. But he also has okay. a sword. Oh, okay. That is Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. Oh, oh it must uh, be like adult Gotenks or something. Yeah, it's, it's, it's adult Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. Um, I have a little figure of him here. Oh, nice. Uh, so. I've got I've got my first double of the night. Oh, yes. Yeah. So I've got Goku and Krillin again. Are we going to have to mail each other our doubles so that we don't... <laughs> if I get... You know, doubles of hit and stuff. You don't get hit. Anyway, have one of my hits. <laughs> I'll take one of your Goku and Krillin's. Yeah, hit me. Wait. Oh, no, I dropped my card. No, I've made a fool of <laughs> Oh, no. You've made a mockery uh, of this sacred institution. I've got I've got Dr. W. Oh, is it the same Dr. W I've got? Looks like it. Yeah. Yeah. He's very, very shiny. Very, shiny very Dr. shiny. W. Okay. So, um... Super Dragon Ball Heroes. If we could... I guess we won't be able to really buy any of the art. Uh, oh, I've got another double. Oh, I'm, I'm doing well now. My luck's run out. I spent it all on chicken. I've got uh, the Universe 10 Kai again. Yeah, uh, I've got Fusion of, of that you got. Uh, V-Danks v, v or whatever. And I got B Pan. B Pan. I mean, from one yeah. episode of GT, that's not particular. Even by GT standards, it's kind of a bleh episode. I think. I think she also appears like that in the intro. Yeah, yeah, she's there on that planet for a very brief time, but it made it into the intro. Apparently, this is a rare card. But no, I mean, this game starts at like common and then instantly goes to rare. So yeah, there is no. Um... Uncommon. Yeah. Yeah. It's just like straight rare. It's like, is it rare when you've got like two it. things above it? <laughs> I'm not liking its uh its super characters I'm getting in duplicate either. I'm already not a particularly big fan of super characters. Mm. Well. Let's see. Oh, another clean cut. Oh, 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 hello. Okay. I've got I've got a guy. Oh, and a oh, okay, You've got a guy. Okay. Yeah, that's basically it. I've got a guy. This guy. Damn. Hello. I can't yeah. beat guy. Oh. Uh, that's the guy from the um, other Dragon Ball movie. Blood Rubies? Curse of the Blood Rubies? Sure, why not? It's something like that. Hang on, let me check my uh, big green dub titles. Uh, I believe that is Sleeping Beauty in the Devil Castle? I've also got another, another double of uh, fusion. Oh, so I don't go tanks. Go tanks. Yeah. And um, black Omega Shenron. Hey, he's black, mate. Oh, yeah, okay. He's black. That's how he was full of negative chi or whatever. That's racist. Yeah. Uh, right, key then. <laughs> um. <laughs> Well, yeah. why, why has it got to be negative? Why is why why is Black Omega Shenron got to be negative? Well, regular Shenron's are negative. Thinking about it, so that means he's a good guy. Uh, mm. <laughs> <laughs> if you got a negative he's villain, he's just he's just pessimistic about everything. Not quite. Oh, I can't get the clean cuts like you. I'm not. I'm not practiced in that. Oh my fucking god! Oh, oh. <laughs> I got hit again. Ah, you fucking love it. <laughs> it's a new favorite character. 
<laughs> and your favorite character? Hit. I have three hit cards. Uh, I have um, non Super Saiyan uh, adult Ooh. go tanks. I do like that hair though. And I have Super Baby Janumpa. Okay, that's Super pretty Baby cool. Janumpa. I think there's a, a set of stories where Baby just infects everybody else. That's a pretty good yeah. card. I like Baby Janumpa. I like Baby. Baby's an alright character. It's just terrible execution. 19 is a rare. Nope. We now, I've opening... dropped... now I'm making a mockery of the sacred institution of opening cards. We're opening Super Dragon Ball Heroes cards on the stream. Because <laughs> we, we have too much money. If we had too much money, we wouldn't, we wouldn't have gone 50-50 on it. <laughs> It's true, it's true. Um, but it's also more fun this way. I'm going to compete, I'm going to throw all my hit cards at you. <laughs> hey, Brett, do you want more hit cards? Oh, I've slightly slightly cut the uh, background, the, 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 the snack card that tells me what's, what these things are, even though I don't know. I mean, it's, we've got like what, five of these already. Ah, yeah. Well, we've got ten, technically. Uh, okay. Yeah, we're going to get ten. Okay, I've I've got that lady who's blue. Okay. I don't know who she is. Maybe I, I Poutine? And oh, there's a there's a character called Poutine. Uh Possibly. Okay. This is becoming my hit, which is Super Saiyan three <laughs> Gotex. <laughs> <laughs> um so that that's my hit and I also have Beepan. Everyone loves Pan. Uh, she's everyone's it's character. Well, GT. Let, I was gonna say if if we get super version of her, where she's just like ultra powerful as a as a baby, basically. You say you think they've made a super? Yeah, oh, I see what you mean by super. I thought you meant like Super Saiyan. Oh man, I'd be down for Super Saiyan Pan. Because they seem to like be teasing <laughs> that Pan is like super powerful. Is it hit? No. But it is the Kai again. Oh, he's your favourite character. I haven't got him yet. <laughs> I'm just getting triples of. Uh, who else did I get? I got. Um, I got Pimp Dude. We haven't worked out who he is yet. Of cubes. Cubes. Cube Man. Cube Man. And Power uh, of Cubes. Um, it looks like Pycon, but he appears to be wearing a different outfit. Ooh. So this is a Zeno Pycon. Time Patrol of Pycon, maybe. Like, that's definitely Pycon's hat and face. Hold it up to the. Uh, yeah, th I think he. Yeah, it's a very different outfit. Maybe, yeah, it looks like a Kai type outfit, but not like we normally see. I, I, well, we know there's Xeno outfits for characters in here anyway. Like, Trunk, uh, Vegeta's got one, and Gotenks has them and stuff. So I wouldn't be surprised if Pycon got one. Hmm. Let's make sure these are on the one side of the pack. Before I go, Whoa! oh yeah, I'm, I'm mastering the, these these pack openings. Essentially. It's final. Okay, okay. I think these are. Oh, hello. Okay. So I've got your. Uh, what's it? What, I can't remember what he is. Pre oh, that's a Grand Supreme Kai. Yeah, Grand Supreme. Okay, there we go. I've got him. I've got Blood Ruby Man. <laughs> Again. Again. And the only new one is Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. Well, I mean, that's the first time Vegeta has appeared in our sets. Like, we've had Goku like twice. <laughs> yeah. That's a pretty. What, what number is that? Okay. Uh, uh, zero, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, 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 yeah, it's got. I like the way they do shiny in this game. It's... Yeah, they're, they're pretty cards. Can I? Can I get the? No, I. I don't know how I did that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I. Mm, okay. I've got um, child Chi Chi. Oh. I put more so... clothes on child Chi Chi. Yeah. Like I, I like to see adult Chi Chi now, but not child Chi Chi. Like, I've got stop... uh, Bulmer again, so I'll switch 
uh, add Bulma to my pile of duplicates. Where's, where's that Bulma card? There it is. And I'm running out of desk space. And I've got very angry Goku. He has no pupils. Oh, I think I think there's a card in the in the heroes that I've already in the actual uh, Switch games I've got. Yeah, I don't know if that's just like he's possessed by something. He's number twenty-two, which is just a rare. I think if it's shiny, it's a rare. Even the commons are kind of shiny, though. Yeah, they've got a very pretty, pretty effect to a lot of them. Right. I, I, I should turn off my stuff because I could have like ASMR uh, boost thing. <laughs> The problem is these, these, um, they squeak a little bit because of the plastic that they make them. It wouldn't be good for ASMR. Okay. Oh, okay. I've only got one new one, but it's one. So I got, I've got Girthy Janempa. Um, I've got <laughs> Janempa. Yeah. I've, the, the, so I've got, I've got Vegeta again. So he's super he's same back. boy. Okay. Yep. Uh, the only new one for me. Is Bulma. Damn, I can't pass up. Yeah. I can't pass up Bulma off onto you. I'm going to find somebody else to pass it on. When she's like, oh, I'll just have, I'll have one trouser leg. That's all I need. One trouser leg. I don't even remember her wearing that outfit in, like, the manga. I think it's on a cover of one of the mangas. Yeah, well, I suppose. Okay. So if I can. Oh! Oh, yeah! Still, yeah, that's the closest I'm going to get to a good. To, uh, let's see, I've got. Oh, okay. Um, Supreme Kai of the West. E. Everyone's favorite, the only female. Um, Cube Man again. Cube Man with the power of cubes. And I have someone from the Demon Realm whose name I don't remember, but I have him in one of the mobile games, I think. Yeah, I think I think I might have played this, played using him before. I can't, I can't remember either. He's a. I'm happy. It's a character. He's new. I don't. Re- I don't remember who he is. <laughs> I was gonna say it's, it's good just to see anyone we've not already seen. Yeah, we're, we're beginning to run out of card packs, so it, doubles are just inevitable, I guess. Because mm. well, there are only like thirty. So okay. Uh, There's thirty, yeah, and we brought a pack that contained sixty cards. So, uh, I've I've now got uh, normal, co tanks. Okay, you can uh, sort the cards out mid play. Uh, super. Safe. I've got uh, Supreme Grand Kai Madabai saying hello, <laughs> and I've got. Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta! Oh, to rival my Super Saiyan 4 Goku, I see, I see. Yeah, I've got, I've got, the, I've got the, the Vegeta, you've got the Goku. What, what Pooms is that? It's Pooms. Yeah. It's 0-4. Yeah, so 0-3 is an ultra rare, which is the Goku, but the Vegeta's only S rare. Hmm. That doesn't make any sense for anyone playing at home. Here is the card. Anyone wants to uh, 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 focus on that? <laughs> I've got the. I've got. If in large print, but it doesn't have the card ratings on them. Ah. And my computer screen is reflecting that, so I'm going to just pick that up. It's, 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 it's very glossy. Yeah, I'm not sure I can recycle that. I can't, I can't get this one open. Oh, no. There we go. Uh. I like the idea um, of you phoning up Japan going, is this recyclable? <laughs> there is a helpline number on it. <laughs> um, Super Saiyan Go Tanks. No, the G Tanks. Thanks. V Tanks. Uh, Lucifer. Oh, yeah. This is the first pack of no new cards. And oh. uh, the Demon Guy again. Ooh. I think this might be Mecha something or other Mecha Mecha Ro Mecha Ru Mecha Waru something like that. Um, like the demon leader god man, like re- regenerated. Ah uh, yes, demon leader god man. Hello, I'm the demon leader god man. What are you gonna call him? 
uh, whatever his name is once I figure out what it is. All right, my last pack. <laughs> Oh, okay, it's becoming a, uh, okay. Becoming a, a Goku and Krillin! <laughs> uh, Gathy Janempa! <laughs> Is it gonna be a pack of nothing but doubles? Uh, no, because I'm, I'm holding off the last, the best to last. Da, da, oh, I like the Oh, oh yeah, wow. baby. What's his pums? I bet that's a, I bet that's the secret rare. Uh, he is twenty-seven. Oh Jesus. no, he's not. He's just rare. Oh yeah, but in as... my book, he's pretty cool. Yeah, no, uh, I was expecting Borgidum performs, but okay. And now for my last pack. Just... Yeah, Widley's not normal baby. You're not allowed normal baby. No one likes normal baby. Show me the baby. Okay, so. Child Chi Chi again. Don't want Child Chi Chi. Don't want Child in Bikini. Oh my god, I, I hate it. I hate it. We got Supreme Kai of the South again. West, even. And we got the redhead demon guy in the coat. My final pack was nothing but doubles. Oh, that's, I was so glad I had one new card in in like in it. I was like, yes, hit Yeah, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine cards were doubles. I will have to sort through these cards to see what new origin. I'm glad that we each got like one of the Super Saiyan fours on the front. It would have been very upsetting had we one person gotten both. It's true. Yeah, we both both got both got a a super save four. I got Vegeta. Go. Just, just just move 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 them over so we can just fuse them. Fuse. Oh, no, no, other side. Other side. My oh. things reversed. <laughs> Gogeta. Uh. Uh. Yeah, wow, that was that was that was quick. They did, they got it right first time. <laughs> so, so yeah, yeah. I'll Which doubles do I have that you don't? So uh, I have to put them in a pile. Two. So I need to. Uh, I don't think you've got Chi Chi. Uh, no, I didn't get Chi Chi. Uh, I, don't know. I don't think you got this old Kai either. Uh, no, I didn't get old Kai. Uh, did you get hit? Uh, no, I didn't get hit. You got all the hit. I got all the hit. <laughs> I'm just trying to... So that's... Because okay. you got Bulma, you got Cube Guy, you got the Super Saiyan. And you got Supreme <laughs> Kai West. So I will have to, at some point, what will you give me in exchange for these doubles, Brett? We'll do a trade. <laughs> uh, that's why I'm figuring out. I'm just, I stupidly didn't put places, places cards out, so I can't see what I've already got. Uh, yeah, I made to... sure to separate out the duplicates. I'm just sorting. I'm just putting out all the cards now because there's only thirty technically. So, uh... oh, I've got many Super Saiyan three ones for some reason. Yeah, I'm going to put these in here because I don't... These cards are not going anywhere. You can't have my Vegeta. Unless, of course, you've got a, a good one to... Did you get Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta? No. Oh, then that is one for trading. I don't have any Vegeta. Oh, Did you get Blue I, Goku? I, uh, did I get what, sorry? Blue Goku. No, I didn't get Blue anybody. Well, other than the Blue Lady. Yeah, you got Blue Lady, but I've already got Blue Lady, so... Uh... Right, Cube Man, are you... I thought I already placed you out, but I didn't. It's fine. Cube Man! Power of Cubes! Uh, did you get Girthy Janemba? No. I think that'll so. be one to trade out. 
whichever man. I know you're not double. I only got one of you. I only got one oh, of you. He's kind of thick. Jack. Okay, these two are the last doubles. No, these aren't doubles, so... Uh, yeah, I've got three Janempas, so... Did you get Goku Krillin? No. Okay, so that's... Goku Krillin is one of them. Gerthi Janempa. Uh, you got one Super Saiyan 3 Go Tanks, didn't you? Um, just scrolling through. No, I had regular Go Tanks. Cool, then adding that to my pile of ones that I can trade with you. Um... Uh, did you get a uh, fat grand Kai? Yes. Did you yeah. get did, did you get Blood Ruby Man? No. Okay. I okay. didn't get any dragon characters. Uh, I think that I... is. Oh, Goku Super Saiyan. Oh, no, I said it. I got Lucifer. He's Dragon Ball. Yeah. So that's. I have five cards to send you. How many of you got? I also have five cards. Marvelous. That's a that's a that's an equal trade. I feel. Yeah. Although I do now also have another. What's this? One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight other cards that I can pass on to a friend that I know likes Dragon Ball, and then I'm stuck with one double that I don't know what to do with. Because <laughs> I've got three of him. You, you, is your, is your new favorite character? New favorite character. Hang on. Have I not included the original in my? Oh, hang on. That should be one I keep. I've done my math wrong. Yeah, that should be one I keep because then I have one of them because you didn't get him. Yes. No, that's fine then. Yes. I've separated out my... Well, the doubles that I will keep to you. I'll swap for you. Well, what are the doubles you're giving me? Wait one second. We'll just put those in the trash. Uh, We have Red Boy. Yep, yep. Cool. Demon, powerful demon man. Oh, nice. Chi Chi. Uh, this guy. And hit. Yay, hey, this hit. Cool. So, yeah, I've got uh Ruby man. From we don't know, I can't remember his name from Dragon Ball. Uh, Super Saiyan three Go Tanks. Uh, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta uh, Goku Krillin uh, and the Girthy Janempa So 17 of the 30 cards, so just over half were unique So half of the 30 we got were um more reason why I put the duplicates. Three, four, five. Again, six, I think I've done my counting wrong. Eight, nine. I've done my counting ten, wrong because I have added a U back ten, into this part. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, okay. 21. So I've got 21 uh, out of the cards. So if I trade with you five, that means I get. It's 26, which is a pretty good going. Oh, every time I count, I get to a different number. Hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, 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 forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six
a hitch act. That's what I mean. Jumper, which is pretty cool. Or and baby hat. Rather. Who the fuck this guy is? <laughs> he Who looks like you? a um, refined version of this guy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, my one's got a little less clothing, which generally means he's like a higher form. And he's got the like the the infinity symbol that Mira and Toa have in Xenoverse, so Who are you? Wait, can I use the lens to tell me what Google Lens? Translate the card. See if I can translate, well, I can translate the boxes, but yeah. Do I have lens? Oh, uh, because it was used to be Google goggles, isn't it? Or something. Oh, so Google Translate tra now. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I'm. Um, I'm. I was. I remember the old. Uh, I think it was lens or something. That was the glasses, wasn't it? No, that was Google glasses. Sir okay, a serious ball. A fighting. Sp oh, there are five. It, it keeps changing. Serious ball. Crowd. Oh no. It keeps changing as I move my card. Oh, can't just stop translating numbers. Conflict during the crowd. A fighting spirit. Cooking for heart. <laughs> mm, Raise the spirit heart. of conflict. It, this is I'm just reading the same thing. It keeps changing. Um, I feel like his okay. So that's his, his name will be at the top, right? But I don't think it understands that because it doesn't quite understand Japanese. So it's like I don't understand why is Japanese in top. In I don't understand why is Japanese. Yeah, what, what, what? Why is Japanese like uh, downwards? That doesn't make any sense. What? You can't translate Japanese into Japanese, you bastard. No, I will translate the Japanese into Japanese. Who <laughs> did that? It's like, changed it. It's like, this is also Japanese. I'm like, okay, that's very helpful. Thanks. Aim at text. This text, you bastard. No, I don't. T translating the serial number. I know what that is. I can read that. And it, keeps, it keeps changing it. So it's like, oh, that's very helpful. Aim at text. I am aiming at text, you bastard. Maybe if I turn it sideways. So you keep saying super something and I'm like, okay. No, that's, that's made it worse. Super 3N. Maybe it's that it, maybe that doesn't work because it's got sideways. So it's like, that doesn't make any sense. Why are you trying to doing it sideways? Now otherwise it changes it to a, like another character like oh super triple D. Oh. Would you like the super triple or super triple la? Super sala? I'd rather Super not have any of those things. Super 3, la. Yeah, try and, try and translate it, but yeah, it doesn't. See if I can... I know Janemper, so... I'm going to try and tra translate Janemper. Uh, you... Uh, something has a fox. I was like, wait, what? Does he? I didn't know. No... Go oh, great opportunity. Crest of cooking. Who has the crest of cooking? Crest oh, of cooking! <laughs> That's where it came up when I looked at Ruby Man. Gourmet Scannon. Before the fee. To the fee. It must be... Uh, thoughts on fee. It must, it must be have something cooking-wise, because he's, he's a thick boy. Uh, every time I... It just keeps taking me back to Card Utaku, which doesn't have the cards I want listed on it. Uh, a super sp super sword that can increase the image given to the enemy when the Nana writing technique is activated. When you do, the damage reduction multiplication of the returned enemy will be reduced by 50%. Huh. Oh, it also has the name on the back. I think that's the name. Now, King Granus? Oh, okay. So, yeah. Oh, it has that name on the back, so I could just do it that way. Because that's less <laughs> not in... Just didn't realise they had... Oh! Vegeta, get off the floor! Translate. Super mirror. Oh, it is mirror! Okay. Fin absorption. He's absorbed Finn. It's not Finn! I know, right? Like, who is Finn? Oh, I could translate the card that it gave with us to tell me what cards these are. Is that it's in black and white, so it should be. There's a 10th anniversary special set they're doing for uh, Dragon Ball Heroes. It looks like it's got Ultra Instinct 
um, player character. It comes with a music CD. Oh, I think it only comes with like five cards and an album of cards. Wait, no. Oh, did I actually put? Where's my five cards that I said? Oh, it comes with a pocket card. Six cards, one avatar card, seven sleeves, and a CD. And they want eighty pounds for that. Mm. Okay, you my you are my separate cards because that's why you're over here. I'm gonna put you somewhere separate. There's no date on like any of the card packs that might. <laughs> Any and all sale and or export of this product outside Japan is strictly prohibited without approval. Oh, I could translate. Uh, Boxman. Who are you, Boxman? Tell me. Aim, t- aim at text. Hearts. Neat. Neat. Normal. So either hearts or neat. Is that in hearts or neat? I don't know. I wish I could just search by his number and then see what who he is. That would make more sense. Yeah, I am just not finding anything regarding this card back. Like, uh, at all. I f- yeah, I found the individual cards, but I can't find the actual card pack itself. If you just search purely by the number. I can bring up on Kartaku. Uh, this is part. Google Translate did work. Uh, is there anyone else? Oh yeah, why is it, why is a Mega Shenron in a weird form? He's got very lots. He's got a lot of text on him. Oh, you mean the uh, Pums uh, thing? Star Dragon Zeno, Super Ichir, oh, Super One Emperor Dragon Zeno, Evil Dragon. Yeah, they've got the former. Hero bullet. That's it. Okay. Ah, yes. Dark King Mickey Bar. Bar. Pums. Aha! Yeah, uh, that was Pycon. The one with the funny hat and the robe that we said looked like Pycon. Uh, yeah, there's it. Um, Baby Hatchiak. Well, they just listed Hatchiak card, but he's quite clearly infused with baby. Okay, it's like Super Eye Shenron? I don't know what that means. Maybe there's some power up in his eye. Uh, apparently, that's this is Solza, the uh, the kid in red with the coat. Oh. Solza. Weird. Ah, uh, the parallel card is a different version of... Uh, the secret card is a parallel card of the this Goku. It doesn't say what set these cards are from, but you can find them individually. Uh, bang see. Booster Pack. Yeah, it just says the Big Bang Booster Pack, which is the one I brought up. Big Bang 2. Mirror. Yeah, that, that's trying. not the cards we have. <laughs> yeah. God, it's such a mystery. Look up. Uh, the... Oh, okay. The girl is Poutine. The blue girl we got was Poutine. Poutine! Oh, and, yeah, back. the other one is Stephen King, Mechibara. Uh, Shadow Janumpa. Uh, so, who else were we confused by? Yeah, I recognise those two. I thought it was Poutine. For some reason in my head. Janumpa is just um Janumpa uh Xena. Uh, maybe it's maybe I need to play more heroes. I still haven't unlocked everything. It's because there isn't like, like story mode doesn't exist in heroes for like the hero exclusive stories. It's just its own game story. Like, you can just do the fights, you don't get the cutscenes and stuff, which are like in manga. Yeah, it's a bit a bit disappointing in that way. Because I want, I want to see all this crazy Xeno bullshit. 
Like, they, mm. like I feel like, yeah, mo- most series don't embrace their like weird extended universe that they've made up. And this one's just like, yeah, we're fucking going nuts, and I'm like, yeah, yeah. No, made you've also all... got Black Janumpa. It's just what he's called. Oh, okay. I just look. I looked him up, and he just said Janumpa. Yeah, but the one you've got's definitely got like darker armor, yeah. so they're not. Yeah. Yeah, but when I looked him up, it just said Janumpa. I was like, oh, okay, you're Janumpa. Yeah, it's like a different. It's a variant of Janumpa. Because I thought it was like the uh, Omega Shen one that I've got, which is also kind of a black one. For some reason, like, Bulma's card makes it look like she's straight out of, like, Saved by the Bell. Except with a gun. Oh, yeah, yeah, but it's just, like, the back the back, back of it is just, like, uh, it's just Saved by the Bell in my head. <laughs> You're probably wondering how I got here. Uh, no, there's a YouTube series that's just, uh, Zach Morris is trash. Um, so, I, I love that YouTube series. It's just very, like establishes that Zach Morris is a terrible human being in, in Saved by the Bell. I don't know who Zach Morris is in Saved by the Bell. I'd never really watched it. Oh, you're, t- you're too young. Um, yeah, it was a little lot- before my time. It was a little bit before mine, but I, it was a lot of repeats. But, um, I never not watched Nickelodeon <laughs> till much later. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's probably why. You didn't understand Screech and why everyone was like, oh no, Screech, why have you become uh, murderer. an attempted murderer? And then died. And then died. Okay, so the one with Goku's got white eyes and looks like he's possessed is just called Son Goku. Like It's just a Goku card. I thought it was like angry Goku or something. I could have sworn he was in Heroes. Is... Okay. Like, yeah, I like Goku. Rage Goku. They just called him just Goku though. You can buy them on card attack. If there's any card of the set you didn't get that you wanted, you can spend like a couple of quid on getting. Yeah. I don't know why I said I'm playing Godzilla Save by the Earth, Save the Earth, but oh well. Um You mean this isn't Godzilla Saves the Earth? I know, I'm sorry to disappoint you. I can't believe I can't believe you've done this. I know it's just terrible. But that that was that was fun. We we got to unbox some weird cards. I'll keep my eye out so I can find any more of the uh, booster boxes. Because if we open them from a different like set, we're less likely to get ones we've already got. Because that's how cards work. <laughs> Thank you, James, for explaining how cards work. <laughs> um... Yeah, yeah, but also, yeah, and especially since now we've basically got almost all of them, like, in the set, we don't, we'll probably just, otherwise we'll get the set again, it's like, cool, we've just got everything yeah, we've already buy, got. Yeah, I'm not going to buy the, the Big Bang box set again. It'd have to be a different um, one. No, we, now we can Big take Bang our cards. Three. <gasps> who's, who's another box? Super Saiyan 4 Vegito. Bye now! Why is it giving me the thing that it's $80, it's about 60 quid. Can I find it cheaper? eBay? No, this is eBay. Oh. Oh, there's one for 70 They got is the original the same... bag booster for 70 as well. Is it the same amount of packs? Yeah, they're, 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 I, I believe so. They're just boxes. There's one for sixty pounds, sixty-five. That looks like to be the cheapest. Because I really wanted, because there's a there's the series and they did a magic where it's like, uh, where they had included a lot of Godzilla stuff, and I was like, oh, I really want that. But then I realised you're going to get one card in an entire box, and like the they had to they stopped printing the uh, Space Godzilla card because its attack was called Death Corona. Also, they they did, there's like three cards they just didn't bother printing in like uh, English for some reason. Like there's three other cards that are just like like I think one of them is like Batra, 
And he's like, oh, what do you guys not want to produce? You're not allowed Mantra. I'm sorry. <laughs> it was so it was so weird. I was like, oh, I really kind of want these cards because it's like it's magic and Godzilla combined. I'm like, I love both of those things. Hell's yeah! If I tried to buy I this whole set, it Godzilla, be... no. Um, it doesn't say on the box, but I'll I'll send you the link. Did... I think they did two Space Godzillas. It might be possibly. I think, maybe, I think they re retracted the Death Corona one and renamed it. I did, I did see it like a different Godzilla, uh, Space Godzilla. It's like, wait, what the fuck is the two gods at Space Godzillas? Space Godzilla is great. <laughs> Big dumb <laughs> crystal shoulders. I love him. <laughs> I mean, yeah, he's, he's dumb. And also, the fact that baby Godzilla got in there, which is impressive. How this is well, at least your camera's no longer the uh, Starry Night, which you used to get on the old one. I like the Starry Night. It had a bit of class to it. I was uh, bringing some impressionism into my video calls. Instead, I, I get mean, bent. I mean, look at look at that door frame. It, that's... it does look like a fish lens. I, I think it is a fish eye lens. I can't change anything like that. But... Yeah. yeah, I'm in widescreen now. That's that's an improvement. Did you get like um? Did not have like drivers you can download to. No, it was literally a web. This webcam was in a box. I did it. it came with a small piece of paper that said, "This is the webcam. This is the camera." You plug in the USB, and that was it. Yeah, yeah but did you check their website? Cause, like, I don't know who's manufacturing. There wasn't a product listing, or like, it was a cheap one off eBay that, that said it was 1080p. Can take the box out. I suppose, and have a look. Yeah, I try, I try and track that down because, like, my my one. Well, my one's just a normal Logitech one. So. Mm. See if I can get my hands on one of them uh, face rig things. Come oh, with... me a message. Oh, oh, it's pink. Yeah, I was wondering if because I bought it last time, you buy it this time. I said you the buddy. Oh, that that like very... look and I think it's about the same sort of price. Even uh, what's the shipping? It's it's free shipping. Not well, not the one you sent me. Is that not the one I sent you? No, this one's got postage uh, £8.74. Are you signed in? Because it might, uh, it might think you're US. Oh, uh, I did. Re yeah, it said anything to the US because I recently sent uh, brought some stuff to send to someone in the US. Uh... Why, is, oh, why, is, why is Vegeta so beefy? Because he's Super Saiyan 4. Let me just quickly. I'll switch on my stream so it switches over to. So I can show. Show beefy boy. Uh, figure out uh, which one is on my. I've got too many. What I'm watching. Look at this beefy boy. He's so beefy. Very beefy boy. Oh, yeah. Well, that's up to the card price a lot. Okay. I'm going to keep looking. See if I can find cheaper. Lots of cam. There we go. Yeah, because that was. Not that expensive. Uh, that one's got free international. I think that might be the one I just clicked. No, it's not. It's two pound more expensive for the overall box. Oh no, it's because that search hadn't updated. Okay. Uh, I found one which is, is this one to oh. Hang on, let me switch this to. This is seventy six quid with free and free shipping. Uh. Oh, some of these are in the hundreds. Yeah, wow, one of these is 150 for just a single booster pack. At least the Damn, pictures. Son. But, uh, Big Bang 3 is 76 quid. So, that's, that's the cheapest uh, one. That's been as nice on two. I found the one you bought, which is fifty-seven. But I don't know why that one's so much cheaper. I guess it's more common. Yeah, that's weird for a booster box. Booster pack. Yeah, what's seventy half? That's 
What, 35 each? Uh, That's getting a bit pricey. 76. 35, 35, get you 70. So, 38 pound? Yep. Don't know why for some, re for some reason the guy shipping from France is way expensive. What the fuck is... Oh, hello. Sorry, I found... Uh, what, what was this... What's the saying in the mask? That's the mask oh. saying, the one that looks like uh, Hannibal Lecter. Yeah, Hannibal Lecter saying. Uh, cucumber, or cumber, or uh, something. Oh, I found Super Saiyan three cucumber. They sure it's not regular Super Saiyan because he's got quite long hair to begin with. Uh, no, because he's very yellow. Oh, okay. He's got an aura around him, and he's basically broken off his like strength. He just got the mask on because he's. Uh, a good person who obeys regulations. Mm, mm. And there's one for seventy-one pounds. Mm -hmm. Free shipping to the UK, I think. Yeah, I mean, it's, it depends on uh, if you're willing to do it. Then I'm willing to do it. Yeah, that's thirty five fifty. Uh, round up, make it thirty six. That's slightly cheaper. I just want Super Saiyan for Vegeta. I mean, don't we all? Oh, he's so cool. He's so cool. Where is he? I've got him in here somewhere. Here he is. I see you, Vic. I don't think I don't. I mean, that looks cool, but I don't think that really illustrates how thick this boy is. I mean, yeah, that thick, like that that card is certainly thicker. Like, I I want him to embrace me. Like, I take a big hug. Easy, from that. easy, Tiger. What? So what? the Super Saiyan Four arms must be very nice to They look all nice and fluffy. They're so fluffy. Yeah, it's a very fluffy boy. Like, surely you want, want, yeah. Don't kick shame me, I'll, I'll take a Super Saiyan 4. <laughs> or, you could have like a Super Saiyan 3 and you could just get like lost in their hair. So, <laughs> like, especially with like Raditz, just, just never be seen again. Yeah. Oh, I see. Where, where are you, Super Saiyan? I, I've lost my Super Saiyan. Uh... Where, where the fuck is my Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta? Why have I lost him? Why can, stop showing me Pan. Why are you no, Pan? No, only Pan. There is only Pan. There you are, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. Who, who for some reason has the kind of golden, the kind of Super Saiyan gold highlights. Super Saiyan gold? Super Saiyan go god. Yeah, that was one thing that looking at these boxes was a bit weird. They had like the god aura, but it it's not. It's just Super Saiyan Four. Still, it if we ever end like, up in Japan, because I don't, I've, isn't Goku's hair black, whereas like Vegeta's is yeah. more brown? Uh, I think the fur is a different color, but the hairs themselves are both black. Looking over at my model kit figures. Oh no! Wait, no, it's Gogeta that's brown. Yeah, Jesus' hair is red, but yeah, the other two have got like scarlet fur, and he's got more of a brownie fur. Mm, brownie. Gogeta, Super Saiyan 4. I started to play as him in Fighters. And yeah. he's red. I think maybe I'm looking, remembering GT. Where is he? And I, I'm fairly sure Vegeta's fur is a different color, but, but that's about it. Gogeta's uh, Fur is brown, but maybe, was, maybe I'm thinking of that. Whereas Goku's is more of a reddish. Or, yeah, sort of a reddy, magenta purpley colour. With those terrible yellow pants. 
We'll try. Yeah. Again. Yeah. Because Goku's outfit in that is terrible. <laughs> and very what was nineties, I guess, because he was. Yeah, it was late nineties. The anime, I'm fairly sure. At least with Japan, anyway. Plus, it's like yeah, two thousands. Yeah, because well, we didn't get Dragon Ball Z to like two thousand and two. I remember my, I remember my satellite box going out at like just before he we went Super Saiyan, like for the first time. So I he was so powerfully pictured. I remember recording each episode of VHS tape so I could rewatch it again and again, but not working out to stop the recording when the ad breaks were on. So I lost like an episode's worth of tape time to just like adverts from the era, and I don't know where that. I think that tape's gone. If I still had it, oh, that would have been a fantastic little time capsule. Yeah, I think I've got some tapes like that where I'm like, oh, that's. But I had to, I had to like slightly fudge it because the sound was weird, so I had to like. Uh, you something that goes into like a a three point five, jack, to try and record the sound as well. Um, I remember, get in France where I collected most of those minifigures. We saw like a start of a magazine subscription run that came with a VHS tape with about two episodes on. And the first you know, issue one came with two VHS tapes because you know, they always give you extra deals on the first one to lure you in. And so we had two tapes. We had the first four episodes of Dragon Ball Z in French on VHS tape for the longest time. We put them in our VCRs. They just played in black and white and I had no idea what was going on. I just liked the fight. <laughs> I got as far as Gohan bursting out of Raditz's pod and like headbutting Raditz and that was it. The cat, that's all I knew for Dragon Ball Z for the longest time. Oh. Just it was in French and in black and white but occasionally you'd see specs of colour fight in because I think UK and mainland Europe had different VHS VCR setups. That's way too before before my time, at least, to figure out on VHS. Yeah, I, but it's not like you know DVD regions where any U European DVD will play in any European DVD player. This was, I think, I think like England had a specific VHS style and VCR style, and that was different to the Americans. That was different to the French. That was different to the Germans. Yeah, whereas DVDs is weird because we like we're part of Japan. Yeah, America region one. Region 2, Japan and Europe. Region 3, everybody else. Region 4, Australia. I think that also includes, like, maybe South America? South Africa, that's what I mean. Um, is Region 2, maybe. I guess it's just based on languages, because, like, Hong Kong and Singapore and stuff, they speak English, so it makes sense to have those ones in the same... No, because those, those are Region 3. Yeah, why is Japan just in, in our region? Like, why does that make it? I don't know. Who decided these regions? Sony, answer my questions. Okay, so Iceland and Greenland were in region two with us. Egypt right. and a lot of the Middle East. Uh, so out of Africa, it's Egypt and South Amer uh, South Africa are region two. The rest of Africa and Asia, uh, including Russia... A region five, excluding China, which is six, because that makes sense. Because China is gonna be, you know, we're gonna be separate for every, everything. Yeah, uh, yeah, knowing how China is. Uh, and wait, there's a bit of South America that is region two, but I can't, I can't remember the country off the top of my head. Like looking at the looking at a map. I don't is it you? Uh, I am. I'm not. I'm. I'm straight. Damn. Thought I'd caught that <laughs> clever, clever ruse there. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> it says you're a gay. Ah, uh, classic Simpson. What? I. What country right? is that? What? Why? Uh, why? South America. I thought America wrong. Like, America and Canada being in Region 1 makes sense. That's French uh, Gagne. Gagne? Yeah, French. Next to Suriname. 
Oh, okay. Oh, it's also a little island as well, so that's probably like. Uh, that's probably also French. It goes. Guinea, Suriname, French Guard, yeah. They have a country between them. Okay, does... I'm guessing they speak French there, so that's probably why they're in Region 2. Same with that one little island is probably... Um, uh, the Dominican Republic or uh, Haiti or something. Uh, it doesn't look like it includes the Falklands, so it looks like Argentina has taken the Falklands again. All, all six people on the Falkland Islands and their sheep can't watch the same DVDs you get in the UK. Yeah, but yeah, if you try to attack those islands, then we'll fucking come for you. Yes, yes, we will. And by we, I mean the country, because. Oh, oh, I was like... getting ready to. Um, oh, well, this is awkward. <laughs> Just like, put away your anime swords. Oh, okay, fine. I'll go use my keyblade behind me. I'll. Uh... I'll show them the true light. Does it have a have, have a keyhole in the uh, Falklands? Why were you there when I brought that keyblade? Uh, I was. You were. It was, it was like the last convention we went to before uh, COVID hit. Uh, or no, like, that would be Star Trek. Star Trek. Yeah. Because then we also did Nightmare Before Christmas. Not technically a convention, but it was a thing. No, but it yeah. was a big gathering of people that is not something we've done since then. True, true. Um, yeah, I liked the Star Trek one because there was a local convention like in a community centre like, in like the next village over and they had the same people that were at the Star Trek one selling stuff. <laughs> Apparently they're local. Fair enough. I, I, thought, oh, I remember you from the Birmingham convention. Oh, we were, yeah, we were there. <laughs> Uh, I've got, I've got, I've got, yeah, I've got uh, Picard behind me, just chilling, mm. as he does, watching over me, going, you, sh you, should, you should have bought me as Star Trek Picard, and I'm like, no, I shouldn't have, because Star Trek Picard is shit, no one likes it. Don't worry, it's getting season two. Uh, just stop, and now they're like, oh, we're going to do... In I think someone says like, "Oh, that looks like a uh, DS9 um, Easter egg in the new trailer." I'm like, "You better fucking not ruin DS9 as well as Next Generation." You son of a bitch. What's the one that people generally don't like? Is that Voyager? I mean, it depends who you ask. Because I'm okay. Not... I know a lot of people don't like Enterprise, but I'm talking about the like the originals because Enterprise kind of almost comes under the sort of revival banner. I mean, because now, well, because like a lot of people now consider anything post Enterprise as new, because technically it is, because it's like it's a certain era. Because Enterprise is technically a part of, part of the old era of Star Trek, yeah, the okay, so era, excluding excluding Enterprise because that's the one that I remember hearing. But because I think it's just it was new. What was the one everyone disliked in the old era? Well, it also then again depends because there's a lot of people that don't like DS9 because it was serialized in an era when it was very hard to watch stuff in a continual order. So DS9 is kind of the, slightly the stepchild, uh, mm. but it's also really good now because you can watch everything it's in order. Uh, whereas Voyager has a problem of being naff and it just kind of does the same thing again as next gen. And the problem of it is like, yeah, it's it's also just like, but you guys could have done new stuff because you're in like in a completely new place and could be like slightly battle torn where you're like, we're kind of hobbling over like, we're trying to survive, and that's why like uh, Ronald D Moore, who's like considered a really good writer, and did like a lot of Klingon stuff in yeah, next gen fast food restaurants, didn't he? I'm gonna slap your face. Um, he did. Uh, he he left it because he was like, "No, nah, this, this is not how it should be," and then left to do create uh, or remake Battlestar Galactica, and make it as basically kind of how Voyager should have been, where it's like slightly hobbling along because they're all by themselves. Mm. And so it's like, "Oh, you lost a guy 
because you guys wanted to do your own thing. It just Voyager doesn't really take any risks. And then just goes, hey, we've got, you know what you guys want? A Borg babe. That's Borg literally babe. how they describe that is literally how they described her in the extras. I'm like, you know what we could do? Introduce a Borg babe. Then you're like, no, that's a terrible idea. Yeah, but then you also looked at Jerry Ryan and you're like, she is hot. Uh, but then also and then just she like, had a backstory so she could fit into Picard. Oh, everyone has to have a shit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And watch, rewatching Voyager and I'm like, ah, oh, I love the fact that. Uh, seven of nine is raising each ep. Oh, I really hope for cut to the Picard where someone's like ripping stuff of out of each ep's face, and you're like, "Oh God, no! What have you done to each ep? No!" Has it become one of those things where, like, because we know what happens to these characters in Picard, it's kind of spoiled watching the old series because you don't want to get like invested in stuff because like you know that character's outcome now, and it's like I don't want to. Because you know how like one bad ending can completely ruin a show for you, like the experience of just watching it. Yeah, I don't think it's got to that point yet. Because I still think, because Next Generation is still good. So did you got Picard and Data kind of, uh, and there's no one from DS Nine, but Voyager has Seven of Nine, who is now kind of kind of badass. So it's kind of alright. Because yeah, she's kind of. Reserved in the original ser- uh, in Voyager, which makes sense because you literally just freshly out of being a Borg. Um, mm. Whereas, like, there's been time passed and now she's become a bit more human in Picard, which is cool. Uh, but the only problem is, yeah, they were like, ah, now she's a- now each is dead, yeah. Which is like, oh, watching watching her her like story of each I'm like, oh, makes me sad because. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the, the example for that I always think of is like uh, Game of Thrones, where the last season, like, was so bad and so rushed and so just, like, even the actors you can see in the behind the scenes of the script readings looking just sad and miserable. It's like, oh, now I can't go back and watch any of the good seasons because how it ends is permanently tainted the journey. Yeah, I mean, it's 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 worrying because. There's parts of Picard, I'm just like, why, why, why Picard, why, why are you doing it this way? And yeah, it's just I can only come, I'll only come back if I get to play movie Picard. None of that highly sophisticated thinker that was the TV series Picard. I must be movie action Picard with bang, bang, bang. But he's not. He's not even movie action Picard because he's just Picard who's dottery, and they're like, oh, Picard gave a great speech when because they basically write the JJ uh, Abrams uh, Star Trek into canon because it's they basically because Romulus like part of the, the start of that story is basically Romulus goes blue blow, blows up and Spock goes back in time with uh, and also is chased by some Romulans um, mm. so that's happened but then they're like oh Picard gave us a really great speech and like can we, guys can we watch that speech do you want to put that speech in the extra show no okay I gave everyone like, no, a really cool speech to possibly. try can't yeah. possibly show you know the thing in a visual medium, and it's like oh, and then also just like the way that it's like oh now and now all the all the androids are gone because the the androids went a little bit crazy. Oh, and also Riker's son died because uh because the robots were banned, we couldn't use the medical advancement that would stop that. Be like. I'm pretty sure Riker would have found a way to do that to save his son. Like, mm. but they also introduced Riker's daughter, who who's well, Riker and Troy's daughter, who's pretty cool. Um, she's pretty badass. She's like the basically the only thing like good of Picard. Um, and yeah, also they they for some reason like I, I'm fine with it, but Seven of Nine they're like also Seven of Nine is in this relationship with this woman. And you're like, wait, what? Where does it come from? What, it's what does, that's something that wasn't hinted at before the previous show. Yeah, or well, not even in, like I, I'm fine with because of like Voyager. Or well, the previous era was a little bit funny about. You know, it's like can't show anything a little bit gay. Because uh, sure is getting gay around here. <laughs> was there's a bit when because they tried to do an episode which was like 
in Next Generation where it's like, oh, okay, there's these like the kind of this race which are all like non-binary people that are just, but they're kind of non-binary in a way that they all look like like um like with a Gohan kind of uh hair. Oh, uh, uh, androgynous. Uh, androgynous. Yeah, that kind of thing. Where, but then they also there's because like um Jonathan Frakes was like, oh, we'll make this uh. We'll make um, I'll, I'll have it as like I'm kissing this this guy. So oh no no, it's gonna be played by a woman. Oh, oh now you're following me. Oh. Yeah, I realized I wasn't following you. <laughs> um, yeah, so they made made it. I've jumped like... into your stream. We've opened cards. We turned it into like a podcast about Star Trek, and now <laughs> I'm like, oh, I should probably follow you in exchange for. <laughs> so, so it's basically like it's like one of two episodes that kind of address. Uh, anything slightly non-straight, basically, in like pre-discovery. Um, so it's like that. Whereas, like, yeah, he's, so John from Frakes was like, "Oh no, she played play by a dude." If we're trying to do like a a gay story, in like, and this is like you know early eighties, no late eighties, early nineties. It's like cool. Um, but it should be played by a dude. It's like no, 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 played by a woman. It's like oh, oh okay, and then uh, she she starts falling in love with Riker and basically becomes female because they kind of get they kind of try to do gay but then also try to do um gender identity it's like so they kind of slightly get those two confused that's going to be a a poorly aged episode I feel yeah but uh, you kind of give it a little bit of a pass because like we tried to do something in an era where there wasn't really anything the oh. era of the the lisping limp wrist did yeah uh, hey! Saving stereotypes, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so what wasn't the stereotypes? It's like, oh, okay, at least there's that. But then also, at the end of the episode, basically goes, oh, and, uh, oh, no, they took her back. So, like, oh, you can't be, like, uh, not androgynous. So she goes through uh, conversion therapy and she's now cured. So it's like, oh, oh. yeah, oh. yeah, that's the problem of it. It was like, oh, you did that. What? Yeah, Why? See. At the same time frame, there was like a, a Disney cartoon called Lloyd in Space that had an alien and the other kids, because it's you know, it just slice of life in alien space shot, and they went to school, and they had this new transfer student, and the girls and the boys like friend groups trying to figure out if the alien was a boy or a girl. And they're like, oh, my species doesn't have gender. We decide when we hit puberty what gender we want to become. And you said the guy, this is surprisingly progressive for a Disney afternoon show from like 2004. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they, they, well, I was going to say the, uh, the other thing I did that with is uh, when Data has a daughter, um, she kind of chooses her gender, um, but which makes sense because she's an android, even though Data is fully functional. Data, Data's got a beard. As, <laughs> as established, he is fully functional. Uh, but yeah, the other any the other episode that was uh, dealt, dealt with anything in non-straight was the an episode in DS Nine where they have um, trills, which are they have human hosts. Well, no, they're humans. They're kind of human-like people, but with a symbiote inside them. So the symbiote carries on like their memories of the previous host. Okay. So it's, so it's like basically, so. These two people re meet essentially at, in different uh, hosts, even though the hosts do have, like, they kind of merge, like the, the symbiote and the, the person. They kind of merge together rather than being separate. Like, yeah, and the host just going, taking over a body. Um, but they'd meet again, and it's basically the first, like, gay kiss in, in actual Star Trek. Um, uh, and they, they kind of also address that in the. Uh, uh, documentary were like, yeah, we did that, but we could have kind of done more. Uh, <laughs> so it's like one of those like slight regrets of the series where they're like, we could have probably pushed for more stuff. Um, because mm. like, yeah, given how Star Trek is, it's like Star Trek is supposed to be super progressive. Like that's the whole whole point of it. It's just, it just doesn't matter. Like, um, which is quite nice. Nice in yeah, Discovery has you know two gay main characters. And now has uh oh hello another one another follow hello Fene twenty um Feeny 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 twenty Feeny twenty 
Uh, yeah, so now, has, and then the new in this new recent series has someone who's non binary, and the actor is trans, but it's not really established if the character is trans. Mm. Um, so it's like, so it's not, yeah, because that's also, yeah, so they don't really establish if they, their char- the character is trans, but the actor is. So for like the non binary character, they like, they kind of like slightly establish it like early on with they tr- address her with uh female pronouns and then she kind of you kind of like they kind of hint in a few episodes beforehand where she corrects people she kind of like kind of slightly winces like but just like kind of just sprinkling in like oh maybe she doesn't like that and then eventually get you know, like correct someone so oh, okay fair enough but it is also to to the um one of the gay characters so so ah um and also i have a picture with me and with uh anthony rapp and wilson cruz because I was, was like, that when we went to the star trek con yes and i met met both of them and anthony rapp became my favorite uh as a, oh, he was another like your shirt wasn't he yeah i was like ah and he covered to my shirt and i'm like ah <laughs> i was just like because i just literally like come, he commented to me, ah, ah, talking about it and i was like and i just kind of came out slightly buzzing i was like yeah <laughs> I, I like that George Decay was like, ah, yes, we made it through. <laughs> yeah, he's great. Yeah, just watching I, I, him like, I, you know, bend down so he's eye, eye level with people in wheelchairs and stuff is like, ah, oh, professional. Because like Chapman yeah, was yeah. just sat in a chair. I mean, he was chatting around, he was riffing, but he was just sat in a chair. And of course, Billy D. Williams just wasn't moving. Which yeah. is kind of how he played Lando in episode six, uh, episode nine, thinking about it. I think you very briefly see him standing up in one shop. You never see him move. He's always sitting down. Yeah, and then there has that thing where he, it, they kind of he talks to his daughter, but it's not really established that his daughter. So it kind of looks like he's slightly coming onto her. And you're like, oh, it's like, well, that's just his daughter. Wait, what? Yeah, just though, like, I mean, it is Lando. He would just come onto her. I mean, yeah. <laughs> but, well, they then they established recently he's pansexual. I don't know. I don't. If if it's been established, it'll be in comics and stuff, and I don't follow the Star Wars comics. Uh, okay, I think they recently established was like, which makes sense because it's like it's Lando, just like, um, which we, we need a Lando film. Let's be honest. Randy Carazian. We 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 need we need a, we need a, a Lando film with, yeah. Um, what's his name? Is face. It, uh, Donald Glover. Was yes. It Dan- he he was so good in Solo. He stole Solo. We need him. That's in. I felt like he's the only one in that film that had seen a Star Wars film. Uh, no one else. No one else has seen a Star Wars film because it was so dark, so they couldn't even see their own film. So, oh, guys, <laughs> could we? Guys, could we see the extra film? <laughs> Didn't he say in an interview something along the lines of like when he got the part, his like mum rang him up to don't fuck it up. <laughs> <laughs> Which is fair. It's like an established character. Established his... character. It's one of the few like black action heroes from the the era. I say, it's certainly like, the only one in Star Wars. The only non-white guy in Star, like the original trilogy. Yeah. <laughs> unless you count, yeah, unless you count Darth Vader's voice. That <laughs> I mean, yeah, yeah, but I feel like I, not many people knew who James Earl Jones was. Maybe, maybe they did. But then they took off his mask, and it was a British guy who's now been digitally edited edited out of the films. Thanks, George. Oh, wait, wait, he's edited out of the out of Jedi, or the end of Jedi, where he's the ghost. Yeah, I think they've they've uh, touched up his face a bit to make him look more like Hayden Christensen would have instead of an egg. He's just a a, a white bald man. I someone told me it was Humpty Dumpty, and I it might have been my brother, it might have been like my dad. This is the sort of thing they would have said. But I'm like, yeah, I'd believe it. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, yeah, we so we we just need to like a Lando film. Like when yeah. they stops, it's like, no, guys, do a Lando film. And now we don't really know what they're doing with Star Wars because it's just like, uh, guys, we don't know what to do. Uh, the it, spin-off it, films it, didn't really work. Making TV shows at this point because they 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 can't mess those up. Watch the Boba Fett one be bad now. Having said that, I mean, no, well they they've given the keys to the kingdom to the guy who did uh, Clone Wars, so. Mm. Uh, what's his? Oh, what's his face? Got his name. Guy, but you know, yeah, the guy who did Clone Wars who 
basically really knows Star Wars as opposed to yeah, it's really the old expanded universe and just pluck things out of it. Yeah, and he yeah. just knows it so well and yeah, whereas everyone else is like, yeah, we'll just we'll just do a new hope again. And then we'll do a film that's very different. It's like, okay, that's cool. What are you gonna do in the next film? Oh, we're gonna completely rewrite that one. What what what? We can do New Hope again. <laughs> put a little bit of Empire uh, the Return of the Jedi thrown in. Yeah. They just needed someone who was actually steering the ship for the whole three films. It's yeah, a, a trilogy where you swap writers is okay, I guess. But swapping directors, no, you should have had single leadership over it. I mean, the original trilogy swapped directors. In yeah, fact, the original was... trilogy had the same setup, didn't it? Because it had George, then someone else, then George. No, I think George was involved, but I don't think he was. He certainly wasn't writing them. Uh, oh, but the could... directing-wise, it was so- someone else for Empire, which is why everyone mm. likes Empire better. Possibly, possibly. But then George, I think, directed Jedi. If though, he certainly had a lot of creative control over the project. I think he was still that the main rights holder. Oh yeah, yeah, he had, had control over all three films. I feel like he might like the sequels would have been a little less repeaty if Lucas still had any form of input on them, because he was always, like, he says in interviews that he hates redoing stuff. Like, he'll go back and touch it up, but he won't remake a film, which is why the prequels are so radically different to the original trilogy. Yeah, I mean, at least the prequels look different. You're like, oh, look at this cool stuff. It's a shame that they're just standing in a box surrounded by green screen, and, you know, uh, it hampers the filmmaking, but it's pretty for the time. I don't know how well it's aged. I mean, I feel like some some actors they talk about like green screen. It's like how how because there's some people that do like theater and they're really good like just with nothing. Like yeah, I feel like that's kind of an excuse in some ways. Like maybe you just need a director to actually tell you what's going on. Yeah, I think from what I've seen of the band, they didn't have that much room to work with. And on stage, you can run around it. You've got a lot more freedom of movement. In green screen, it's very much. Here's your little bridge platform. You can't move off of that, and we'll add everything in digitally at the end. I, I think it's. I think it's just director-wise. It just needed more. So someone going, so, okay, you need to like, do this, this, this. Movie this. actors and theatre actors are like a different breed of people. <laughs> That's why you can get theatre actors. That's why you get Patrick Stewart to be in Star Trek. There you go. Problem solved. That's why Star Trek's good because you have you brought in Patrick yeah, Stewart yeah, as a theatre actor. Went so well. Picard was ter- uh, just, just because he got into the writer's room. Let <laughs> don't, get... don't let them into the writer's room, for God's sake. Don't, yeah, don't let... Well, you can let sometimes let the actors in, but, like, yeah, no, no. Don't, don't... No, no. Because... No. I think oh, we should I need to... uh, wrap this up now, because we've been streaming for uh, over an hour and a half, and we've we've, we've finished unboxing. This is this is very true. It's just become Star Trek and Star Wars. It's just become, it's just become the the podcast we never made. When when's our podcast series? We should do a podcast series. <laughs> only uh, if we get to do only if we get to open more of these cards. Uh, I've got something in my PayPal from something else I've had to do. I did recently. If I wire that to you, your turn to buy the packs and do the shuffling. <laughs> Keep it yeah, fair. Yeah, yeah. Keep oh it yeah, fair. yeah. That's why I did. That's why I said to do one two one two. Yeah, because um, like they came in two decks, uh, ho- like half the cards are in each of these slots. So I could have just given you one half of the box, but that didn't seem as fair. Because what if the two good card you know, packs of the super rare cards in are in one half? At least when we put them all together and shuffled them, we had a bit more, you know, random element. Right, so I'm buying this this most recent link you sent me. Yeah, that's the cheapest one, I think. Do I click buy? Do I... It also says the 30 of 1. 30 plus 1. Yeah, because there's there. 30 cards plus 1 secret card that's not listed. Which, from what I see, is just... Like, for... It was a variant of this Goku for our set, where it's, instead of him shooting an energy beam, he's doing the Dragon Fist. Ooh. Okay, that is. We would that? never have known that. <laughs> I, I can get. We would never have known. 
Okay, so I can get economy sh international shipping or standard international shipping or extended international shipping. For some reason, standard is just £2.40. Two dollars and forty cents, which is weird. I'm not now. I'm just gonna buy the free. Two pound and forty dollars. My God, that's <laughs> like forty-four dollars. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's just let's, let's just go crazy. I'm not, I'm I'm gonna buy it. Um, uh, have I ever sent you money? Manage contacts. I mean, you you could probably guess what my like. I I guess I probably have. I'm just not sure I've ever sent. I must have done. I guess I haven't. Oh, there you are. Your picture is Kirby. Yeah, I think I, I was. I just had a Kirby on me while I was doing it. Because so. I think I sent you some money for a um, dual stick for a PSP. The thirty five fifty, wasn't it? Uh, let me check my PayPal. It is seventy four pound and ninety seven cent. Uh, ninety seven pence. Seventy four. Dot ninety five divided by two thirty seven forty. So I'll round up to thirty seven fifty because you know because it's you. Ah, it's like four. It's it's four seven five, which you'd round up. I mean, you do because I, I remember you when we were in the hotel room. I was like, I'll just t turn the volume on. I nope, turn it up one more point. It must be an even number. <laughs> it must be a round number. You can't have it at three. No one has the volume set to three. It's four or two. Five you can get away with? I, I think uh, I have my monitor set to like one because I'm I just I normally I sometimes hook it up via the through the Elgato, then to, into the monitor, then out into my headphones. I think I sent I you money from my credit card, not the PayPal balance, because I'm a genius. <laughs> <laughs> Well, yeah, yeah, I sent you the money through my credit card. Oh well, we... I get air marked on that. <laughs> Jet James Rose has sent you three thirty-seven pounds and fifty pence. Yeah. Even if I rounded down that point five of a penny, it would still have rounded up to fifty. Ah, no, I'm fine. I'm fine with that. No, I'll, I'll find an envelope was... and you can pass me your address because. I don't know the next time I'll be down and I'll mail you these five. I will I will mail you these five. Eh. I'm holding things long enough for me to see them in stream so I know that they're on camera. <laughs> if if we get the deal on camera, then there's no, yeah, no we... take backs. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I have a friend that I might try and path, pass these uh, six on to. Which are uh, the triples and then four doubles that you already had. Yes. The... You, get, you get a shiny. I think the the best shiny you get is uh, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. It is a very nice shiny. But I quite like the gold trim of the um, Super Saiyan 4s. Oh, yes. Well, unfortunately, we both get one each. Which is going to make the. Volume three interesting when there's only one box character. Oh, Who gets oh I'll be so upset if I don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> well, we shall find out who who gets it next time. We shall do this next okay. time on Super Dragon Ball Heroes Unboxing Z. Oh, oh, wait, oh. <laughs> Yeah, and Super Dragon Ball Heroes Big Bang 2 Box Thing Jig Big Bang Mission Magoo. 2 Box 3 Yeah, we, we get it on 3 um, The Death of James Wait, what? Huh? <laughs> no! No! Alright, I'll catch you later Alright, bye Peace Hey, thanks for watching my video. Um, if you could come and check out some of the other videos on my channel, that would be really nice. Really help me out. Uh, if you want to click the like, hit the bell, click subscribe, do all the things on YouTube that people always suggest. Uh, so if you could do that, please, please consider it. Thank you!